Previously, on Life is Strange, Episode 1. What the hell? Whoa. That was so surreal. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? So what do you want? I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! No. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. Sorry. Right. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. Class. We can talk more after class. Teach us. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me Little after class. Was a French and I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're, we're definitely gonna rewind. The Daguerrean process. Invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> oh! And now we continue. Um, I'm willing to. I hope do, I have enough time to go to the bathroom. Button? Is the right trigger please, the wrong button? Please. Yes, the right trigger is the wrong button. I can't button. tell anybody. Okay, Max, retrace every step. All right, here we go. I washed my face, I shredded my photo, then the butterfly flew in, and I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Okay, uh, fire alarm, fire alarm. What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down. I need a hammer to break it open. Shit. Uh, oh, oh, people oh, trying oh, oh, to oh, control there it is, there it is, there it is. You're going to get in hella more trouble for this Grab than it. drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever oh. touch me again, freak! Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just hey. saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Epic save. Leave. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? What the? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. What? Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Yeah. Go away, security douche. Jeez, what the hell? What? That's always girl's excuse when they go to the bat. Who are you? Let's just go. Hold on, Max. Come back here. Ah. Oh, what is with everyone on our case? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Um... Yeah, let's report him. Dude, he brought a gun. I just saw Nathan Prescott 
waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? No, I want to see what this takes. I mean... Yeah, screw that. <sighs> oh, outside. Fresh air. Soft guitar melody music in the background. Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Thank you. What the? I was going about to say something about that, and then I just noticed that. So... Where? Where to go? Saw the drone. Where to go? Oh, hey, Miss Grant. What are you doing? Speak Hi, to Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security oh. penitentiary. Uh, it could have helped Rachel. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound, bless our soul. But this petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. You know a lot. You know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, Will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Sure, why not? Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Here we go, one more time. Here we go now. Oh, Hayden, what's up? Hey, Hayden. <laughs> there she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell, especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. What is this Vortex Club, seriously? What the hell is the Vortex Club, anyway? It seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night, then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. Hang with the Vortex Club? You mean hang with the Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. 
Chillax, paranoia girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. Really? Um, let's go for Rachel. So you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh, yeah, and she was hot. Uh, what happened to her? What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace? Uh, he seemed kind of suspicious of that answer. Uh, to be honest, he really did. Uh... Did Victoria like Rachel? Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. Okay, uh, was Rachel in the Vortex Club? Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. Uh, Nathan Prescott. Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. Yeah, he's unstable. He seems genuinely unstable to me. Nate has his extreme moments, but don't we all? I don't know yet, Hayden. Yeah, extreme moments. Does bringing a gun to school count as an extreme moment? Or way too extreme? Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Nope. And that photo in the distance looks like Hannibal Lecter without the mask. Brooke, what, what are you doing? Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Uh, I'd love to. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Uh, come on, there's gotta be what? Huh. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Reverse. Hi, Brooke. Let me get. That looks like a high fly drone. Model B400 EVO. Uh, now, that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. Here, give the drone a whirl around campus. Hey, wait a minute. That fo that freaking statue looked familiar. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm gonna test this out on everybody that's out here. See, see what happens. And no, I am not flying the drone at the moment, people. I actually want one of these little drones. I always want to do some like side film clips and whatnot, and this then one of these things would be interesting to have. Let's end that. All right, here's your iPad back. Um. Sorry, what the hell. Hello. Sorry, I'm running late on the same day. I'm um, eating a lot. Looking cool. You'll see.
see my camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Uh, doesn't look like anybody's down this way. Um... I don't know. I don't know, just cigarette butts. Oh, what, what do you guys say? Ooh, gross. At least switch to E6. I will agree with that statement. What's this? Oh, that's not nice. Poor little otter. Alright, um, we get all that. Um, ba -da 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 -da. let's actually check out this statue first. Um, what? I knew it! Okay, so. A skateboard. I'm willing to bet. This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody got their wish. Okay, it's been an insane day. Let's take a moment before we go over to the skaters. Guitar, this day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. find out what's going on. Max, it's you and me against the world. Kind of. Uh, what was your name? Justin. Uh, Yo, right? Justin. Check out the Max. Come to thrash? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh, flip. jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Max. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to thrash? I came to no slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah. I just can't skate worth shit. Aw, oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Uh, to be honest, I, I, I usually had some skater friends and I've watched them do tricks I've seen a, a, a good amount of nose slides in my day so tree flip go for a tree flip let's get Trevor all over that action oh, oh. oh wait that wasn't there before I see a small light line what it says Trevor what why is that Read an insult here. Yeah, let, let's let's take a picture of this poor man that's got his nuts racked by his skateboard. Oh man, <laughs> it's the broken skateboard. Uh, this makes no sense. Um, isn't this one? Isn't Stella, I knew it. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. Uh. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? Sure. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. 
Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Uh, I'm not going to say anything. So. Now that you mention it, he doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. That means he has good taste. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well, I heard that from a good source. Uh, you knew Rachel? So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Okay. Um... Daniel, was it? Oh, Danny boy. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I, I'd be honored. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Uh, what happened to her? So what happened to her? There's gotta be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. Uh, you knew her? You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. Uh, hard to avoid her posters, eh? Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Ah, she had a good heart. Uh, well, let's get started with the drawing. Okay. Why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way! You're a good substitute, Muse. Oh, that's a good posture. Good. Good. Best portrait ever. Evan, mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous fallen soldier? Oh, man. Um... So if you have to go eeny meeny money mo. It landed on Robert Kappa. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. Great. Well, that was a victory. <laughs> Rachel. Okay, so this guy knew Rachel. Um, oh, speak to him Hi, again. Evan. As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite model here. She knew exactly what angles worked best with my eye. Uh, you were close? You were close. Like brother and sister in arms, she understood me. Never judged me. I hated her Vortex club click, but she never acted like she cared. Her friends were her friends. What do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. 
I see. Uh, see you around, Evan. Um, who are you? Graffiti, what? Funny. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. Well, can I have your muffin? Um, what's wrong? What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. You, you know him? Um, I busted him. I busted him today with a gun. What? Seriously? I saw him wave a gun around today and I went to the principal. We'll see what happens next. You are my new hero. Finally, karma comes to Blackwell. Oh, yeah. Um... That was me. I'm glad you told me that, Max. Let's talk later. Cool? Yeah, dorms. Come on, like, Logan, bring it, bro. Okay, apparently Logan. Well, I bet the other guy is yeah. Zachary. There's Alyssa. There's Samuel. I, wait, who's that in the distance? I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Oh, that looks like Kate. Uh, let's talk to Alyssa. Wait. Oh, God. They're on the steps. Oh. Hi, Max. What are you reading? What are you reading? Love today or die forever. Don't even say anything. It's a bestseller. What to say? Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> uh... No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Okay. Um, let's talk to Kate. Kate. Yeah. Sweet. Found the drunk squirrel. Take the picture and yay! Got it. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. Um, you look down. You look down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Okay. Um, Samuel, was it again? Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. Uh, what's with all the posters, man? Seriously. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. It just makes the campus look sad. Nice. You can't color over that sunlight. Uh, what happened? What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward, like a clock. I have the sneaking suspicion Samuel did a lot of LSD in his past. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. Yep, a lot of LSD. That's a tripping hippie. What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was like a battery. Nice, bro. Positive and negative. Mm -hmm. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. After I sweep, I paint. After I sweep, I paint. All right, let's go f in front of the bitch squad. Oh, look. 
Look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. Yeah. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh wait, hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. <laughs> Sprinklers. That door wasn't open. Samuel, what did you just do? Oh, uh, well, I gotta look for the, uh... I guess I gotta look for the pressure right there. Um... Is it in here? Ah! What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Uh, maybe that got her out of the way. He, do you understand English? Get lost. Oh, come on. How, what else am I supposed to do, huh? Kick your ass? Oh. Rewind. Let's go faster, 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 faster. Must go faster. It won't go any faster. Okay. Yes. Damper with the bug. Okay, let's see if this works. Oh, yeah. You were looking at the ground. You didn't see me. Now let's go hit this water pump. No. What the hell? Are you kidding? Fast forward. Ah. Aha. And. Boom goes the diamond. No way! No fucking you okay way! <laughs> oh, Samuel, is sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Oh, yeah. I five, Max. Awesome. Uh, let's see what Victoria wants. Uh... Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I could go with make fun of you. But I'm gonna see what comfort does. does. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. Okay. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Uh, we... I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Earn brownie points. Nice, bro. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about... Blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Sweet. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. Yeah. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Oh, we earn some respect. Victoria probably played. So, I think from what I read, 
She's only been here for three months. Oh, what does it say? Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Juliet, extreme reporter. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. Toilet paper, what? Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. They live. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, this is just mean and stupid. Will bang for Jesus. That is so freaking. Draw. What do we draw? What do we draw? Come on. What do you, what do you draw? What do you draw? Peace out, bitches! Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. Oh, this is our room. Um... How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Now you do. And we are saying... <laughs> okay. Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. 